To log on to the Tiger Prism website, your Tiger Prism administrator should have provided you with a URL to log on to the portal. This will then automatically log you on if you are a single sign-on user. Or you may be prompted to enter a username and password, either through a third-party website or through the Prism login portal, as per this screen. If you are prompted to enter a username and password, this will be provided by a Tiger administrator or will be provided by your IT department. Please enter the login credentials to enter the portal. Once logged onto the portal, you will be presented by a group of tiles. The tiles are based upon your level of access provided by your Tiger administrator. To customize your Tiger Prism portal front screen, you can do this by clicking on the portal drop down and the unlock button. To navigate through the portal, you click on a tile to access that page. To return to this main page, simply click on the icon in the top left hand corner of the web page. Or you can use the most recent modules option. Or if you are on a current tile, use the module drop down and click on an option to go to another module. If at any point you would like to change any of your personal settings, you can do this by clicking in the top right hand corner on your name drop down and a list will appear. From here, you can now set your font size, change your theme and set my settings or sign out from the portal. To change the font size, simply select small, medium or large. To change my theme, simply choose the color theme from the list. To change my settings, simply click on the My Settings option. From here, you will be able to change your language, your time zone, and set your password if you are using a Tiger Authenticated account. You can also set the number of modules you wish to show in your most recent module list. Thank you for watching. We hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. And if there's anything else you would like to learn about Tiger Prism and its other modules, please visit www.tigercoms.com for more tutorials and information.